my god, it's the pupper! Already fan art? I'm definitely doing well. Welcome back. We are going to design things. This is the intro to the video because that's, that's how, how good I can do it. Okay, I'm, go I'm just gonna make a poll. So, the winner is very clearly Design New Starters. Um, so we are going to take new inspiration for new designs for new Pokemon. We're gonna make the first, at least the first evolution of those. Uh, we'll see how far we get. If we get more time, we have more time to do more, then we'll do more. But most likely we'll just do the first evolution and then I'll do another video with the second, another one, the third, I don't know. We'll see. I don't know how much time we'll have. It seems like... Yes. It seems like everyone wants me to do three starters. Alright, let's go! So to start off with designs like this, I like to, to do just notes, just to come up with ideas. Um, ideas usually come when I'm sketching as well, it depends, it depends on what I'm feeling. I'm also very bad at writing. So, what should we start with, with the ideas? Should we make them? Because the Sword and Shield are based on the UK. <gasps> Can we make them based on Norway? Could we please do that? That would be so cool. It would just work really well with me. Let's do that, honestly. They haven't done a Pokemon game based on Norway yet. Scandinavia, thank you. Yes. I like your enthusiasm. So, um, grass for Scandinavia, I would think... Either moss, a uh, spring flower. Spring, spring is a big thing in Norway and Scandinavia. It's just when the sun finally is out for longer than just a few hours. <laughs> Wood. <laughs> what is our? Oh yes, we are. Nakken. I think it's called a nit. Or is it called? Nuk I'll just do that. I think it's just like a swamp. Do we have any... I guess actually we could do troll, it's a big thing. So far we have a lot for grass and water but we don't have anything for fire. Northern Lights is interesting, that's a very interesting uh, idea. Oh Lucia, yes! Santa Lucia. Is that called the same thing in English? Julebok, yeah. <gasps> we can... yes. So that's pretty much a goat. I like the idea. It's it's going to be. I feel like it's going to be a goat now. I just want it to be a goat. Yes, the goat. <laughs> Could you do a fire ice Pokemon though? Is that even possible? The flaming goat. Could be if it's a forge. We could make it steel fire. Right? Isn't that a thing? Sleipner. Ooh. We can put some Sleipner inspired thing in here, like a goat with <laughs> eight limbs, <laughs> eight legs. I don't know if I want to actually, we might put some Fenris in here because I love Fenris. I'm starting to get an idea what we're doing, so it's good. It's very good. Snipe me Fenris and hell. <sighs> Probably more Jormenskad. That would be so cool though. But don't they have, doesn't they? I feel like he has tons of kids. It would be cool if the starters had like each of the kids and then you have the legendary ones that is like other ones of the kids. That would be so cool. Um, okay, so I have an idea. We are gonna do... I don't know how to write his name, but it's a worm. Okay, I have an idea now. I'm gonna c combine the wolf with the troll because I really want the wolf. And then for fire, I'm gonna do goat and Sleipnir, and then I'm going to do Nyx and Jormungur, the worm disruptor on the earth. Wow, that's an interesting picture, isn't it? Okay, I have an idea what to do. I'm going to sketch our first uh, grass, grassy, grassy boy. So this is going to be the first evolutions of all the starters, and I just I just had an idea and I'm kind of excited for it. So we'll see if I can manage to. P. 
going to be real cute. I haven't decided on this yet. I'm still like going back and tweaking and stuff, but you know. I do my thing. Don't like how that leg is looking yet. We're gonna figure that out. I think I'm gonna render these up a little bit more than I did the fake ones from yesterday. I'm gonna just flip you around. And it's not too bad. It's one of the rare occurrences where you flip and you're like, okay, this is fine. Just need to adjust this leg. Cool. So I'm gonna leave him at that and I'm gonna sketch the other ones. Because this is just what I've had in my head when we were talking about these earlier, so. So hard to give them eight legs though. It's so easy, much easier to just give them six. So should we compromise and give him like that looks weird. It would work better if we just had six limbs, like that. Oh, he's the fire type. You know, um, Thor has um, goats that helps him fly. <sighs> we can add that in somehow. I wanted to give him long long legs. This looks weird right now. I will fix it. <laughs> what, what other ideas would we have in here? We can give him a light. That would be cute. Hell. So I want to put in Lucia and like the fire and everything in here. So. I don't know if I can make his. I don't think I can make his horns like candle wax. I don't think that would be a good idea. I think it'll look really weird. Like that? <laughs> nah. Uh, let's put it there. We could try the the horn thing, as you guys want that so badly. See, I think that looks silly. But maybe that's more Pokemon for you. <laughs> this is, no, this is not gonna be... It's not gonna be valid. Honestly, no, I think we're gonna keep him like this. I think when we evolve them we can do more crazy stuff. It's just, the, the starters usually look pretty normal. Like, they don't look like crazy, you know? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm very excited to do... Um, color this guy. We're gonna put some more. I think maybe I'll put moss or something on him, like mold or moss, like a stone. Okay, we need to do our final the, the water though. Has there been a fish starter? Because there's this one illustration that every Norwegian person knows, and that is this one. Oh, a neck. Okay. Nick's neck. I thought it was, I was saying it wrong. So he can trust. He looks like this. It's really creepy. But like this is one of the most famous illustrations of him. And I want to take that into uh, inspiration. It's really creepy, but I love him. Maybe he can evolve into a big dragon-like thing, kind of like um, Magikarp. I want him to be like a ghost water. Honestly, I would love a ghost water. <gasps> Lily pads. Yes! It would be like a mud kip. <laughs> kind of like a tadpole, I guess. Oh, I'm using uh, the... Can you see it? No, we can't. Uh, charcoal pencil medium. It looks like sadness. I want him to have some sort of something that looks more like... Mm, I think I want to give him a tail. It's gonna be a big water serpent boy. No! 
Okay, I think I love him now. <laughs> I just saw him again and I was like, oh, cute. Yeah, I mix it. I had to mix something into it because he was just looking like a blob. Now it's a little bit better. I kind of wanted to um, to color them in like like they look like three D, like a model. Bird starter. I could just go and get my Pokemon game honestly, but I'm just gonna look at how they look in the game because I want to make it look similar with the lighting and everything. I'm gonna copy this. This is a picture of the starters in game. So we're gonna make it similar to that. Cause you know you girl gonna make it more than just line art for this. No, I need to do line art. It shouldn't take too long though, cause they're very simple. But doing a thin line art, cause if you look at the, the 3D rendering, the models, you can see they've added line art to it. And if I do that, then it will be easier for me to do a clean render very quickly because they're very simple, the render. Will the final evolution be quadruplets? Because I'm kind of... I, I, of course they're gonna be on four legs. Are you crazy? This guy is gonna be on eight legs. I am all for that. This is gonna be a dragon thing, so it's gonna have tiny legs. So, I'm excited for it. Oh, I see, I see, I see. I don't know, I have a thing for dark type Pokemon. I'm like, you need to be cool. Let's try shading it. I'm actually just color pick out and use that. <laughs> try to be like quite reasonable with how much shading they have. It's not that much of it. Overlay or is it? It looks just like white. So probably screen turn that down. Yeah, they have. That's, I noticed that. I was like, I, um, I think I was playing. There was one Pokemon that I was just like, the rim lighting is the same color as um, as another color on their body, and I was very confused about what was what for very. For a little bit. Oh, I want to give him a really big. That's just what I like. <laughs> oh, well, you know what? He looks like fire with the red. <sighs> like a. Um, make him look. the black. I just don't want him to be confused with like fire, you know? So I want green to be the pop of color. But that looks like fire as well. He's grass. That could work. The ultra guy. Yeah, that's my, that's my goal here. Alright, uh, we got those guys. I'm just gonna add all right, let's do our angry goat boy. Oh, I opened the window and that helped a lot for me. After we're done with this year, I'm gonna go play some more Pokemon. <laughs> But I'm having a lot of fun, so I'm very happy I decided to do this. 
<laughs> Candlet is kind of cute. Because you guys have the best name ideas, I never have name ideas. I just, I'm not that good at names. I'm good at designing, I just can't. Don't give me, <laughs> don't make me make names because I don't know how to. Okay, let's do some colors. Colors, I know I want the, this part to be like creamy. Very angry. Those Pokemon have like gradients. They usually don't, right? They have like sharp. So the color to be like coffee. I was thinking that too, but I don't know. I kind of like them being red in the face. Makes them look look angrier. <laughs> I like that. Just want don't want it to be too too close to our. Uh, Wolfie. Did you make the yellow body earlier? Yeah. But they, it takes away from our main focus a little bit. I don't know, maybe it's the ears that's like throwing us off at the moment. I don't know, blue ears doesn't that throw it off a little bit too much? They have blue eyes at least. Demon goats. Blue who's? I don't know, we can, we can use this blue. There's like a level of how much you can actually do with a Pokemon. Oh, well, that's cute. We can do, do, do that. It's like a blue gray, so it's not too. It doesn't throw it off too much. Sp speckles? Yeah. I'm gonna leave the speckles for later because I don't wanna go too overboard. Like, we still have two more evolutions of this guy, so we can do a lot more. <laughs> Okay, last one you guys. I'm excited to try and color this little one. I'm trying my best. We're gonna do more streams where we're gonna do the 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 pre-evolution and the final evolution. Is that what it's called? Next evolution. <laughs> anyway. Oh, it's only been three hours. Oh, oh, not even three hours. That's interesting. Green and light blue gray. Yes, that's a very good look. Yes, I like that. Thank you. <laughs> They're just for the, the blue light because I'm just staring at the screen. It kind of destroys my... My, uh, my eyes a bit. Oh my god, it's the pupper! It's my little pupper! <laughs> It's my little pupper, that's such a great drawing, it's too tall, thank you! Already fan art, I'm definitely doing well. Darker or lighter? He's also gonna be very, very yellow. I think darker maybe. We can make these ones like blue instead. Or like black blue. That's cute. I don't know, um, cause I'm kind of, we could... Because I'm following this fan art, well not fan art, but like this art from a very Norwegian like illustrator. I think every kid knows this. So I wanted to like follow this. You can we can try doing this. Give me a second here. Is that better? Maybe we should make the eyes more uh... A little bit more creepy. Oh, I have a I have an idea. Can do that. Can you like half the eyes? Wait, wait for it. Can this work? Is that cute? All right. So this is the old one that we had before. Yeah, I do like the new one. Good, great. Let's keep going. We need to do the, the shading. They're all like, oh, guys, is he a bit too close to our pupper? 
Yeah, let's green the pupper more. Let's see if that works. Is that good? Muddy pupper. Yeah, but we can't like make him gray anymore, I think. I'm just trying to look at it. I think that looks better because it's not as green. Actually, no, the, the, the green is nice too. I'm confused. I'm confused about everything. Yeah, I think this this looks good because now he looks like a uh, a like a troll to me. We had a flower 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 on him before, but that's too much detail for a starter. We can add that later. If we did make it pink, it would be better. Oh, that looks good. Damn it. Let's. I'm gonna throw on some uh, shadow now because I need to. Um. We can change this color later, as you saw, like, it's very easy to change the colors. <laughs> Tools! Somebody asked about that again. <laughs> I use a freak program, everyone. Well, they don't look like Pokemon. Well, maybe a little bit, but not like their end model. Let's 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 borrow this thing or this one. Oh, there's so many. So did we have a was it did we call it kidlid? Moss Mossub Mossub is cute. Oh, this is hard, guys. Who was it that came up with amazing <laughs> names the other time? Because <laughs> we have Midgard is like the we could try and like combine it with the the creatures they're supposed to be. So there's Fenris, Sleipnir, and Midgard, or like. Jordmundgandr, but that, that's a really hard name, so Midgard. Midgard's worm? I don't know. Kidnid. Kidnid is cute! We can't have we can't have Fenris for the wolf, because that's too on the nose. Yormip. Yormip is cute. Fenrit? <gasps> Fenrit is cute! I don't know, is it too... Fenrit? Is it too... Um, cute, like... Okay, last one. It's a Kidner or uh <gasps> Wickner. Kidner, Wickner? Kidner or Wickner? Wickner. <laughs> that they all end on different things. That sounds nice. We just have to go beyond up and beyond when we do the next evolution and the final evolution. We really have to go uh, get that that like really good. Anyway, I think that is the end of the stream. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, we are gonna do the second evolution of these pocket, pocket fake, fake Pokemons um, in another video. So if you're interested in joining in for the designing of that, go to my Twitch channel and follow me there, and you can join in and chat and have fun. And that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.